Then you hit this one, which is great. So I've moved everything because otherwise everything came from the top. And then you've got your system. But I put DaVinci Resolve on my installer. I'll put a link to the installer in there. But let's just go through what's pre-installed. So utilities, nothing really new. System, science and maths. Libre, you've got maths. Office, great. Media playback. You've got a few more. You've got VCL pre-installed. Internet. Yeah, and for some reason, Steam's appeared in there. Thunderbird Mail and Firefox. Help. Um, all these numbers in Steams and games. Okay, development. I've got a packer because I put some AI on here. I've installed it on Lama. I don't know what those Git code or Git DAG things are. To into yourself, that's on. Now, you, it's what it's done is split everything into the audio production, graphic design, and video production. Brilliant. So if I hit video production, already it's put Resolve on there. Great. Blender, Free Show, KD, and let's fire that up. I've never run it because I've always just go straight to Resolve. So this is the other one that. I don't mention them. I mentioned, but I, I obviously steer everybody towards Resolve because I know what it does. But yeah, it's great. Editor, brilliant. I'm sure people swear by this. Uh, file, it's got a view, clips, all the tools you need. So if you don't want to do Resolve, I'm sure this will do the trick. Let's come out of that. It's even got a color page. Just not open that or I'll get, I'll get agitated. So video production, what else have we got in there? Don't know what that is. OBS. That was the weird one. OBS was installed, but it wouldn't run. It would, wouldn't record audio. It kept far enough an FFmpeg error. So I reinstalled FFmpeg and I reinstalled, went and pulled the newest version of OBS directly from the, from GitHub. So you shouldn't really have to do. 